Hi guys, today we, we are going to learn how to make just a simple person. There's lots of different ways you can do it. I'll just teach you how to do like the body. Okay, so let's get started. What you're going to need is a loom, a hook, and lots of rubber bands. <laughs> so, let's start. First, we need to choose out, pick out our hair color. I'm just going to yellow, because that's like the most normal hair color, or orange. Any color you want, even like black or pink even. Um, so first you're going to do the top here, the V, as I like to call it, the upside down V, as I like to call it, or the little mountain. Um, and you're going to put one band down, and then you're going to do band down oh and all of this is double band so two bands for each one one band down over here one band down okay so that's all for the hair after you do that part you're going to get skin color out and you're going to do this side, the middle, and this side again. And then you're going to do the little V this time, the upside down mountain. And you're going to do that. And then over here, the middle part, there. Okay, so that's the head. Now we're going to need to do the neck. What you're going to need for the neck is three skin color rubber bands. This one's three. Just three skin color rubber bands. And I'm going to put them on the peg here and then if you're gonna do like a, sh a short sleeve shirt then you're going to get your shirt color remember double band go down on the shoulders And then down in the middle. Gonna go down on the shoulders again. That way. Okay, so that's all for the shirt. And then you're going to do whatever color you want to do for the pants or shorts or whatever you're gonna do. Get that out, and then you remember double band. You're gonna go once down in the middle, then you're going to go all the way down on only the two sides, and you're gonna keep on going down until you get all the way to right there. Do that on both sides. Okay, so if you're going to do pants, this is what it's going to look like, except with a different color. Or this color if you want to. And, and then you're going to do socks. I'm going to do gray socks, or white socks, actually. 
White Sox. I'm gonna do two down, two down again. And that will be your socks. Okay, and now we're going to do the arms. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna need skin color band skin. You're gonna get one, wrap it around your hook three times, and you're gonna get double band, hook it up here, and I'll put your band that you twisted onto that band. So that will be like this. And then you're going to put do it three more times until you get to the um when you have three bands on there, not including the band that you put on at the beginning. So if you include that, then it'll be four. Okay. Now if you're doing short sleeves. If you're doing a tank top, you can do it two more times with skin color. If you're doing short sleeves, then you're, you can get the sleeve color that you want. I'm going to do it kind of like baseball tee, so it's going to be like that color and then another color and then the shirt again. And we're, go and we're going to then. So, this... I'll get the shirt color on the hook, put that on, so that's like that, and then you're going to get another color if you want, or you can just do the shirt color again, and you're going to put it on the hook, put that on, and it'll look like that, and then this is going to be your arm. Then you can put it on right here. And then you're gonna for and then do the same thing for the other time. So cap band around three times, then double band, and then the double band three more times. The shirt color. Shirt color, and then another color. Okay, and then you're going to put it on. Ah, didn't lose any bands. Uh, okay, I'm going to put it on right there. Twirl. Ah, bands are coming off. Ah. Okay, there. I'm gonna put it over here. Okay. Now we're gonna do the eyeballs. So you're going to need two blacks or whatever color you want your eyes to be. I would suggest a dark color. Uh, at least a dark color like black or dark blue, dark green, like that. <laughs> Going to make it go around, put it around the hook three times. And then you're gonna put, get the other one, go around the hook three times. Okay, so those are your two eyes. Then you're gonna get a skin color, just a single one this time. Gonna do that up onto that, and then you're going to do that again. Okay, there's your eyes, and you're gonna put it right there, right where it turns from hair color into skin. 
uh, you're going to separate those eyes. I'm going to get the middle one and put it up on this peg right here. So the eyes look like that. Okay. You got that? Them should look a little bit like this. Now, if you want like braids or pigtails or something like this, then you're going to get your hair color again. Just going to do short little pigtails. Go around three times. And you're going to get two five bands put on there. And you can do it as long as you like, like we've been doing with the sleeves, like we did with the arms. Except don't do a different color because that might look a little weird. But if you want to, it's fine. Um, I would suggest just doing one solid color. Okay, I'm just going to do like four, five things. Okay, so when you're done, you can have like little pigtails or you could like, after you, we could do those legs, you can make like a little bun thing and stick it up there. And then, after that, you're going to get a cap band, whatever color you want your shoes to be. And you, I'm going to do, I'm going to have black shoes. I'm just going to do a cap band. So, one, go around three times, like we've done with others. One, two, three three and the other one okay so when you're done your room should look a little bit like this and now you're going to get a color that looks like your pants stretch it and put it across those two right there and put it like that go up in a triangle. Actually, you're going to put that bottom one in triangle too. Uh, then you're going to do the one. And now we're going to start hooking. Okay, so what you're going to do, you're going to stick your hook in the cap band, and this one. Pull up your sock, collar one, then your other one, up to there. Okay, so when you're done with that one, you're going to do the rest of this one. So before you do this, um, unhook here real quick, right here. And you're going to get another color of your pants and put it on the triangle so that's tighter. But that, that part you don't want to be loose because it looks really weird if it's loose. Okay. Now you're going to do that one. It might be a little hard. Right after you do that one so that it doesn't pop off, do the one underneath it too. And now we can do the other one over here. Don't do your arms yet. Hold on for those. Okay, so now for your arms, just the same thing, but push down the arms so that you can fit that over it. So just push it down and put the band over it and then you're going to stick your hook through the, your arm and you're going to grab 
the two that go onto the neck. This part might be a little hard, okay? But you're gonna stick your hook through. Make sure to get all three bands of the neck. Pull and put them right there. 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 And now you're going to get the top two ones. I would suggest pushing down the bottom two so that it's easier to get the top two. This part's really hard, especially on the first two. And then the next two are a little, a little easier since one's already done. Okay. So now that you're done, you're g going to get these, this middle one, up there. And now I'm going to get to the spot where your uh, hair or braids or pigtails, whatever you, you want to call them, call it. I'm gonna just put it on top like you did with your neck one or your sleeves, arms. And you're gonna stick it through there, and grab those two, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. Make sure they don't break. Okay. Now that you're done with all of that, you're gonna stick your hook through all of these, get a hair color band, and you're going to hook it through. You're gonna Bring it back through. This part might be a little hard. Bring it back through is hard. Sticking it through is easy. Okay. So you're going to make a slip knot. So you're going to get the front one underneath the back one and pull. Okay. Now that you have the slip knot and so that all of this won't fall apart, you're going to take it all off. I would suggest using your hook. When you're done, Person likes the shoes a little bit. Okay, the person should look like this. Okay, this is the front. Um, if your eyes are sticking through the other way, just push them forward. Your head should be a little rounded, like a little bull with handles. And you can kind of like pull down your braids or pigtails to make them kind of go down more then your arms pull down too if you want and then legs there you go and there you go a little human if you want to do this just make their arms a little longer and then stick a your hook through there and there and make a slip knot so that it's there and so just little humans, human charms, hook them on your backpack if you want. Or you can hide this, the slip knot and play with them like dolls. And that's all for today. Bye. Thanks for watching. See you again next time.